Something I could do. What's up, divas and Devo? So your girl is back with another video. We're gonna start this one off today, really simple. Um, I'm doing like four videos today, okay? Be the only one that is going to be adhered to my scalp or my head, okay? The rest of them are gonna be easy breezy wigs. So you know, I'm really excited about. You know what? When I have a good day and I really be wanting to work, like I really know how to explain this, but when I have a good day, I have to have like good vibes. I have to have like good feng shui. I mean, like, you know, I want to do a video, but then I don't want to be in like a bad space or place. So I try to be in like a good mood and a good, have good vibes. So I'm in a good vibe mood today. I mean, like, look at my shirt, everything I know I learned on the streets. Walmart is my place. Target to be having like the bombest t-shirts. What I've noticed though lately is Walmart is really, really outdoing themselves like with name brands. I like Walmart. I go to Walmart and I seen like the cutest stuff in the boys section because you know, I ain't got no granddaughters, okay? I got four grandsons, no granddaughters. I got Reebok, hello? Like, where are we doing that at? They have like a lot of brands in Walmart. I was like, I seen this shirt. I was like, oh, I'm getting this. This is really, really cute. I loved Sesame Street when I was a kid. PBS was the place to be, okay? I seen this, I was like, yes, this is definitely for me. But anyway, I'm in a good mood. We're gonna do this hair tutorial. So anyway, I got a wig here and I work with this company, I think once, and they're company the name of their company is today only now the first wig that i ever did for them it came out decent the hair was decent you know what i'm saying it's affordable hair so don't expect it to come with sparkles glitter gemstone pot of gold or anything like that but it's a decent hair so i did get a 13 by 4 lace frontal this time it is a peruvian wave deep wave you know i love wigs when you ain't really got to do much even though i've already bleached the knot pre-plucked the knot sewn in an elastic band and washed it um, on standby i do have this even new york tinting lace spray i'm not sure if the lace is going to like complement my skin tone and we're gonna get into this video but before we get into it we're gonna get into it and we're gonna see how that wig comes from today only when you receive your unit from Today Only Hair, you'll receive it in their sat ink satchel bag, which states Today Only, focus on your beauty. They'll also send you a complimentary stocking cap or weaving cap, which you can wear to protect your hair from the unit. Along with that, you'll also receive some strip lashes. The unit that I received is a 13 by 4, 18 inch Brazilian deep wave, deep curly lace frontal. This unit is really affordable as they have many different units that are in a great price ranges. This hair is in its natural color. If you do prefer a more natural hairline or natural look, you will need to bleach the knots on your unit. I went ahead and used a 30 volume developer for about 45 minutes. Along with that, I pre-plucked. Make sure you check out today only as they have many different units available. I'm sure you'll find something there you may like. guys the norm the norm i think i did a real good job on this lace wig you guys with the bleaching and pre-plucking of the knots and thinning out the hairline i think i did an okay job so like i said i've worked with them before this is like the second time the hair texture is nice it's you know it's affordable this wig was supposed to be 22 inches but it is 18 inches either way it's super affordable it's 154 dollars on the website you can get Brazilian, Peruvian, Mongolian. I mean, you can get like a bunch of different type of origins, okay? It does state that it's kinky curly on the website. We already know that it's not. But it's more or less like a deep wave. So, you guys, I mean, I'm going to leave all of the information down below for you. And you could check it out. I like the color of this wig because it's in its natural color. It's not too dark. You know, I do see some that are really dark. But I like this color a lot. It's more of a me color, like a more natural, natural color for me. But, you know, hey, either way, I'm, 
listen, I'm just rambling, girl. But you already know the steps of what I do to the unit. So I'm just going to stop rambling. <laughs> direction lately nothing's coming my way keep drowning every bit of my devotion sinking deeper every day and lately i am missing my reflection and everybody puddle on the pavement driving every thought into distortion mm-hmm. but i will get it up work even harder my mama used to say that it's the way it goes feelings gonna make me smarter and to realize that This was really easy. Um, it's an affordable wig. Like, you get what you pay for. Like, seriously. I don't mean that in a bad way. It's an affordable wig. I think this is, like, the second time that I've worked with them. And um, it's an affordable wig. You cannot go wrong with a good affordable wig. Here are the pros to the wig. The lace, actually, I didn't, I'm happy I did not have to spray any of this on it. Like, it's not like I don't like to spray it, but why would you want to if you don't need to? Like, you want something that will blend without having to do extra work. So I was glad that I didn't have to use the tinting spray. And it's, um, and it fit comfortably. I didn't have to cut over the air tabs. You know what I'm saying? I didn't even, like, hairspray this wig down like that. All I did was just do a baby hair here and, and the sideburns, like... You know what? It's not that I don't feel like adhering it down, but it'd be just so much. I really don't like to adhere my wigs all the time. I would like to just put them on and just adhere the sideburns with some hairspray and be out the door. And you know what I'm saying? So I'm glad that with today only, I didn't have to do that today. Okay. It was supposed to be 22 inches, but I'm really honestly not feeling like it's 22 inches at all. It is, to me, like 20 inches. Now, I did notice that the ends got a little bit um, thinner on this, if you can see right here. And it did start to shed some. So I'm not like a huge fan of the ends, if you can see that. And I did wash the hair last night, and I allowed it to air dry. You can also cut the ends if you're like not like a huge fan of the ends. Like I don't really like the ends like this. So I would definitely cut them to make them look a little bit more healthy. But I really don't feel like this is 22 inches. They might have sent me 20 and didn't realize it. Either way, it's a decent wig on a threshold of one to 10. I would say it's, I would rate it like a six and a half, okay? Only because I would have to cut the ends and it did seem like it got a little bit thinner at the ends and because i thought it was 22 inches but either here nor there it is shedding a little bit it could be because i plucked it it could be because i bleached it a lot of things but it is shedding a little bit but for the most part the cat fits great it's affordable you know when you get affordable wig you just need to know how to take care of it you don't want to do too much vigorous stuff to it i think like it'll pass acceptable is it going to last forever it's definitely not um but it will last longer if you take care of it properly let me know what you think cunties i'm gonna go I will leave today only's hair link and information in the description box below. You already know what I got to do after this video. I got to do me another one. So I love you all. Make sure you rate, comment, subscribe, share the video, thumbs it up, and I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace out.